Hey guys, what's going on? Joker88 back for another video, and we're going to be talking about my Alfa Romeo 4C. So I can call myself an Alfisti now because I own one of these things. <laughs> it's cool to belong to something, right? My previous videos, I showed you guys some of the things that I added, some of the mods that I did for my Alfa Romeo 4C. We put in the cold air filter. That's, some of you guys were saying, man, that's awesome, that's cool. You know, put some more videos on modding your Alfa Romeo. Some of the moddings that we're gonna be doing today is not just for the Alfa Romeo 4C, but for other Alfa Romeo. And these things are fairly cheap. I'll give you guys a link below for those of you who own Alfa Romeos and you can get this stuff for your own car. The first one that we're gonna put in is this. You're looking at your car. Nice, nice. Wow, carbon fiber, nice. And then you get to this little nasty thing, a nasty piece of aluminum. It's the latch for the door. Okay. So what I bought was, I bought this. Let me show you. I got this one in black. They come in red, black, I think like silver color. I'll put the link below, but it's cool. It's got the Alfa Romeo script right there and the Alfa Romeo logo up top. And this is, you get four of these. And since I only have two, perfect. For those of you with the Julia or the Stelvio, hey, perfect for you. And it, the best part is the price. Check it out. Dude, you can't beat that, right? Even though if it's crappy, dude, you can't beat it. It feels pretty good. I mean, like, you know, it's like a tin. And in the back, you have like a 3M sticker. Okay, so here it is. We're going to take out the strip to expose the adhesive. Son of a bee. <laughs> okay, there. Alright, so now it's ready. And what I usually do is I would use a little bit of, I would use my heat gun to kind of just heat it up a bit to so activate the, um, the adhesives on it. There you go. Let's check it out. Looks a little bit more custom, right? Than just having this this like open aluminum here. Maybe red would have been cool. The only thing I was worried about red is that it might not match match the red as perfectly, so I'm like black would probably be better. You know, because the car is covered with black all over. So let's see if the door's gonna close. Afraid. This is it, guys. Hey, <laughs> closed. All right, let's open it. And look at that, it's still there. Yeah, it's still in place. Uh oh, it's kind of loose. Okay, let's see how this works. Let's do it. Cool, right? Yeah, that's awesome. There you go. I think I'll order other colors so I can kind of change them up here and there. As you can see, the price was pretty cheap, so I can probably buy all the colors and not go broke. Pretty good. Okay, let's get to work. Let's take out this 3M tape. OK, 
Okay, what's next? These ones. Let me zoom out a bit. Do it like this, like that, facing the car. Yeah, that makes sense. Wow, this is the easiest mod ever. <laughs> so when people put on the seat belt, hmm. Let's see the other way. Oops. And again, guys, the price on this thing is fairly. Fairly cheap. So you're not really breaking the bank on this. Again, I'll show you guys how much I paid for it. There's even different styles. Yes, right? That makes sense. So that when you're putting, when your seatbelt is on. Crap. There, so when your seatbelt is on, it reads the Alfa Romeo on there. Cool, right? Okay, so that sits there. While it's not in use. Pretty cool, let's do the other side. Go ahead and tuck it in. Tuck it in there. Closes. Bingo. And you're done. Okay, so that's that. Look at that. Turn this light off. Cool. <clears throat> okay, the, we have the floor mat, right? It has like the metal badging right there, it says 4C, and you have the Alfa Romeo Tricolore sign right there, the edge, and it's trimmed with red stitching. And the next one is the Tricolore emblem badge. Right here, that is from Alfa Romeo. Uh, it comes with the template, so it goes in the right perfect spot. So that's it. And sadly, I got another one, but it's not gonna work for my car. Because it's, it's for like the Stelvio and stuff like that. See these? These are those projector lights that goes in your, in your car. So when you open it, when you open the door, it will shine the light on the floor. But the four C's don't have any lights. Why you may ask? This gives weight to the car. I know it's nothing, right? It's minuscule. But the biggest, their main goal for this car is light weight. So they forego on a lot of things that can make your car a little heavy. So maybe I can raffle this off. Give it as a prize for our lucky subscriber. What you want to do is, here's, yeah, definitely let's do that. I'll give this away. I'll mail it to you and all that stuff. All you got to do is comment below, you know, I want you to comment what Alfa Romeo you have. If you have a 4C, a Giulia, Stelvio, 
Unfortunately, there's only two. So for those of you Stelvios or Julia owners, you're only going to get the two. So maybe the, the front two. And I'll find, I'll give you the link where to buy that one so you can get the rest. Okay, and I think, and the last thing I bought was a keychain. Pretty cool, really solid keychain. It's front and back, Alfa Romeo logo on it. Yeah, man. And here they are together. When you want to get off the darkest ground. Alright guys, thanks for watching the video. And don't forget a little raffle here for you Alfisties out there that has an Alfa Romeo. Not gonna work for your 4C unless you probably drill some holes and run some wires, but I'm not gonna do that. And but if you're a Stelvio owner, just comment below what kind of Alfa Romeo you got, Alfa Room, and then I'll do a raffle. If there's two people, hey, your chance is 50-50. <laughs> Good for you. And I'll let you guys know in our next video our winner. Actually, I'll probably DM those people that won. So just make sure you click on subscribe and like, and you're in. Alright guys, next video, talk to you soon.